just by way of introduction, my name is uh, Stuart Andrew. I'm the Member of Parliament for the Putsey constituency. Um, I'm very delighted to welcome you all here to Parliament today for this most fantastic event. There's been a lot of work been going on behind the scenes to make uh, all the arrangements for today. We are here for the Kids Unlimited Celebrating Achievement Awards. Um, this is a, a wonderful organisation. The Wiz Kids Charity is a group, uh, a charity that I've been involved with for a short time, uh, but it's been a pleasure to be involved with them in that time. Before being elected, um, I worked in the hospice movement, particularly in the children's hospice movement. And during that time, I saw how important it was uh, to make sure that uh, people have the right equipment so that they can have their independence. Independence is key, and in my view, it is a right. At the hospice, I saw how equipment supplied by this wonderful organization really made a difference. Um, and since I've been elected, it's been a pleasure to get to know in more detail uh, the work that WizKids does. That first started a re reception that was held here, and it was a pleasure to meet uh, many parents uh, and young people and listen to the real difference the charity had made. And from then on, frankly, I was hooked uh, on this charity, and I've been working with Sally and Mark ever since, two uh, very inspirational people who, um, well, in fact, once you say you'll do something, they won't let you go. So. <laughs> But providing the equipment is clearly, obviously, a very important part of what they do. But they are much more than that. Uh, there are ambassador clubs uh, and individuals up and down the country. Uh, and I had the great pleasure of going to visit the club uh, in the city of Leeds, a very active club, where I got one hell of a grilling from, uh, from the individuals that were there. They were very articulate, very powerful. And they were very relevant in raising the issues that mattered to them. Um, and I know that many members of Parliament were interrogated by uh, the charity at the conferences, each of the conferences. And in addition, I think what's wonderful is that they often campaign so that people can see beyond the, ch the chair and see the individual. And I think that's really very, very important. So as I say, they are a wonderful organisation. So far, 2,500 uh, young people have been helped with equipment, training, and advice. But it is frankly shocking that there are still some 70,000 people uh, who need help. But today we're here to celebrate uh, the achievements of these young people. Now I know it's said time and time again at awards, uh, but I really do mean it this time uh, when I say that every single person is a winner. Um, it, it was an honor for me to be a judge, but it was an incredibly hard task. The, uh, the nomination forms that we read were full of inspiration and some dedication and hard work by young people. I found it all very, very inspiring. And who says that young people are not interested in politics and in their community? So without further ado, I think we're now going to see um, a video on the promotional work of WizKids. Kids just want to be kids. At WizKids, we provide wheelchairs which help them do just that. But 70,000 children are still waiting. Please donate at wizkids.org.uk. Hi guys, Sam and Mark here. Sorry we can't be with you today, but we're actually in Glasgow filming. Yeah, congratulations to all the nominees and the winners. You are fantastic role models, and obviously WizKids is a massive, massive charity in both of our hearts. So well done, keep up the good work. Have a great day.
that's not shell So the Bible said that it still is new Mama may have, Papa may have. 